going to start to draw the sphere now and what I'm going to do next is to just draw one more circle that's not too bad a bit there now I'm not worried overly because I can shade that in be a little bit flat at the top there and I'm gonna as I'm shading in I'm going to assess it and then work the drawing. I can see that there's some really dark, nice dark tones here. I'm just going to check my pencil for some dark tones, see what my pencil does. It's quite dark. I'm going to do a mid-tone. Like that going to do a light tone just holding it and the weight of that pencil just to make those light tones okay so I have a dark medium and light tone and as I'm working the drawing I'm going to be blending those in I can see that that this area here I'm just going to lightly put in that circle that's where the light, lightest part of my sphere. So I'm going to start off by doing some dark tones around this area here. So I'll just start to shade in. Don't have to go too dark in the beginning. You can do it quite lightly and then gradually get dark as you go along. Just as a demonstration purpose, I'm just speeding up a little bit. I'm following the contour of that circle, following it around, just blending in some of those tones there. You can see that it's a bit dark on that side, so I'm just putting in a tone there. Now, as I'm working towards the center, I'm going to get lighter as I move into the center. Getting lighter. You need to do that all the way around your drawing. Getting lighter as you're following the shape. Now here it's quite a strong line, so I'm gonna try and just blend that in so that line just disappears. Okay, just keep working and then you'll get it right. I'm gonna move around to this side, a little bit there. A little bit there. Might have gone a bit too dark there, but I'll try and work that later by blending that in, putting in some dark tones there, a bit there. You can see that it's starting to turn into a sphere. Now as I'm moving into the center, I am getting lighter and lighter, so I'm easing off on my pencil, not making it too, put too much pressure on there, then gradually Getting lighter and I'm gonna say I'm just gonna hold my pencil very very lightly and just sort of flick it across in controlled tones that's gonna be the lightest point okay. just blending those lines in knitting them together Incidentally, I found that ball, it's actually a cannonball. I found it in a field and it was just smiling at me as I'm walking in this field. So I picked it up and realized it is a cannonball. Started off as a stone and some soldier, probably about 400 years ago, was made it, carved it, shaped it, ground it into the shape of a cannonball. 
Now I've found it and I'm using it for my art. Love finding things like that. So you can see I'm working that drawing. As I'm going along, I might just need to nut up a little bit. It's all about taking your time as well. Don't rush. The exercise is to try and concentrate on your tonal values, dark, light, working it to get it right, all the way around. Okay, here I'm just going to very, very lightly put in a little bit more tone. Just bringing around those, knitting those lines together. And I think that's not bad for a first attempt. Have a go.